Hey there everybody, Matt Carter here. And Jessica Carter. This video is our latest Grey's Anatomy season 16 finale theories and we are going to try to get to the bottom of the messiness that is the Teddy, Owen, and Tom situation. And oh boy, that's messy. How is all of this going to be resolved? I mean, we have a couple more ideas. We've looked at the promo again. There's some interesting stuff that is sort of in there. But before we dive in and discuss anything further, if you guys do like this video, remember to give us a like, subscribe to the channel, and ring that notification bell. We have a lot more stuff coming. And remember, the finale is airing on Thursday night. The moment it ends, we will be here to try to break everything down. Absolutely. Okay, so Teddy, oh Teddy, what what are you doing, Teddy? Yeah, this is, Teddy's being messy this season. We've learned that her daughter is named after a past love, which is odd, odd to say the least. <laughs> yep. Um, you know, she's been messing around with Tom behind Owen's back. Messy, not cool. Like she's playing with Tom's feelings a little bit too in that way because she knows that he wants to be with her and loves her. I mean, we even saw in this promo him saying, Teddy, you don't throw your life away. Don't marry this guy. Don't do this. I mean, it's so messy. And I said this before that I feel like Teddy needs to not marry Owen in this finale. And she needs to figure out what is going on and stop hurting everybody and hurting herself. Like she just really needs to figure it out and make a decision. I don't think she's going to marry anybody in the finale. This is my theory and I'll, I'll try to hone it down in a few different ways here. Because ever since she sort of came back into the world of this show, it has kind of just been a mess sort of from the get go where she ends up becoming pregnant, how she becomes pregnant. She wasn't with Owen at that time. Owen was going through everything with Amelia then. And then pretty much ever since that point, there has just been sort of constant drama. Will they or won't they? And I don't think she's really had that much time in order to breathe and make real decisions for herself. And even now, she's put herself in a position where She's been with Tom, and yet she's trying to sort of shove those feelings out to just be married to Owen, this person who she knows she's cared about forever. I think she's going to get there at the last second. She'll be thinking everything through, and it'll be like, oh, I, I can't do this to myself. I can't do this to Owen. I need to find a way out of this. Yeah, so the one moment that we saw in this promo that really stuck out was it looks like she's wearing her wedding dress and she's taking her ring off. So we don't know when this is happening. Is it happening before she's about to get married and she's broken it off? Or is this later in the evening after she's gotten married and she's having this, oh man, I made a mistake and I've gotten married and when, you know, you're taking all your dress off and putting your rings on the thing and you've already done it. it yeah. I think that this is going to be before. I also don't think that she's going to end up going through with it. I think her talk with Tom is going to stick with her. I think even if she didn't talk with Tom, I think she knows in her heart that she has to take the time to figure it out. She really rush this being like all right we got to get married let's do it right away you know what are you trying to do i think the subject that i have the most problem with with this storyline is mostly i don't know what we're trying to say with all of this it's sort of like with a lot of the other storylines with the luca for example i think there's a debate in there about genetics and whether or not you know he is manic because his father is manic are we reading too much into that and with Meredith and her prison storyline it was all mm -hmm. sort of about insurance and the struggles that certain patients have and it's just with Teddy I don't really know what we're getting at here unless we're eventually just sort of building into a sort of deep-seated emotional issue that Teddy is sort of going through where she kind of comes to terms with this idea of I love multiple people but in loving multiple people i'm not being fair to either one of them and i'm not being fair to myself what can i do to make this situation different 
Yeah, I mean, and she has some options, but I mean, really, the biggest option is to not be with either of them until she really figures it out. Because I do not think that we're going into any kind of story where she's going to end up being with both of them in some sort of poly relationship. I don't, I, this is not where they're going. Grey's Anatomy, I do not believe we're doing a thruple storyline. I don't no. think we got to I don't think we have to think that that is where we're heading. Because I just think, plus... We've already seen how Tom and Owen feel about each other in this whole situation. No, they're not going to deal with that. They are not going to share Teddy. Not This is not where we're no. going. And, but you're yeah. right. We're not really diving into, like, what what is this storyline supposed to really be about? And where is it really supposed to be taking us? Is it just sort of a another relationship story? Or is it going to go deeper into that idea that we saw when she was at the conference, that you can love multiple people. And if you do, then how do you live with it? How do you go day to day with it? Do you have to just make a decision? Can you make a decision? I mean, if that's the story we're getting, I mean, that's the story we're getting. I, I, I think we're getting more. I, I hope we're getting more. I, I believe that the writers... Are prob they probably set up something so that maybe there was supposed to be closure on this before the end of the season, which we're obviously not getting because the yeah. season is ending earlier. But I think that where we're probably heading here is Owen will find out the truth about Tom in this episode. And Owen is not going to be thrilled with it. I think he would be upset no matter what. But the fact that it is Tom who belittled him and treated him like garbage for the you know first few episodes of this season... I think that is only going to exacerbate the issue. And then I think the question then becomes, you know, can Owen get past this? And Owen is not someone who is particularly great at being decisive all the times. That makes it yeah. even worse. Well, it's also, can Teddy get past her feelings? I mean, just because you say I do, it's not going to be like, all right, well, now I'm done with my feelings with Tom and that's all going to be fine. I mean, they still see each other every day. So I... I'm thinking that with the synopsis, we do learn that Owen's going to find out something surprising or shocking or whatever it is, which is probably going to be that Teddy's been with Tom. She's going to, he's going to find that out. I think this is going to be more so really a story about just what Teddy actually wants. And you can't run from your problems and you can't hide from your feelings that it's you deal with it or this happens. I still feel like in the end, we're probably going in a route where Teddy and Owen end up together. And that, that and I'm not saying I'm sad about that because I do like Teddy and I do like Owen, even though this whole situation has been a mess. But what happens to Karasik after all of this? Because I do, like, I really like Karasik. Other than when he's, like, telling Owen off. He's one of my favorite characters on this show. Do you then try to be like, okay... We need another love interest that we can bring in to just make Tom happy? Or are we getting too much into the, we're going to have three million characters on Grey's Anatomy so that everybody has a love interest? I really, really like the Tom character. And a lot of the reason why I like the Tom character is because of Teddy. Teddy is the one person that has been able to pull back the curtain on Tom and let us see sort of beyond this sharp-tongued exterior that he's putting out on everybody else and his ego that she's able to kind of get through it and let him be vulnerable and be a little fun like the snowball fight and stuff like that. I mean, we don't get to see that really unless he's with her or around her. So if she does choose to be with Owen and that relationship's over, do we get to see that anymore? Is that just gone? It's a it's a question I'm wondering. I'm also just wondering in general if Tom is going to be gone in general because and I don't want Why Tom, do you say things I like don't this? want him to leave, but this is the thing. Tom Karasik is incredibly accomplished at what it is that he does. That's been made kind of clear, but from the moment he ever first turned up on the show, I think he could pretty much go wherever he wants. And if Teddy ends up just sort of smashing his heart at the end of all of this, what's really keeping him at this hospital anymore? I mean... I think 
I mean, that that storyline about the billionaire that gave all this money to the hospital might be enough to keep him there because he knows that he can make a difference with that kind of money. But yeah, it's hard when it's, you know, that that kind of money and power up against a broken heart. I mean, a broken heart can really just strip you down to nothing. It can. So that that's my biggest concern into the finale is that we're going to see something that causes Tom to leave. Because I, I don't think we're going to be losing Teddy. I don't think we're going to be losing Owen. Owen's been a part of Grey's Anatomy forever. I don't think we're going to lose another longtime character, basically. Yeah, we've already lost Alex. Yeah. So, so, you know, I if we don't lose Tom, I would rather that I like Tom. I'm over losing people right now. I think we can... I think that that money story of what happened with that billionaire yeah. or whatever could really come back for a really good storyline for Tom next season. And I hope it does. I hope they give him something substantial that's not just about romance. We all love romance, but sometimes Grace, they go a little hard on it in just one direction. Yeah, and some of the best stories this season have actually not been about it. I mean, I've loved the Amelia and Link stuff. Don't get me wrong. I'm all in on that, and that's been amazing. But some of the stuff that's been going on with, like, Richard and Meredith trying to help him, like, that stuff has been really fascinating and really engaging. It has been. So I, I hope they kind of move in that direction, moving into the finale and beyond. But for now... Let's get your guys' thoughts on this. Do you think Teddy should be with Owen or Tom? And what do you think is going to happen after she does make a choice, provided that she makes a choice? Let us know in the comments. And if you guys do like this video, remember to give us a like, subscribe. And if you want to support us further, check the link in the description to the store. And we'll see you here next time.